Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Europa Universalis 4 as now finally Zoroastrian Timurids and look at this we got up to our force limit just like that which is really cool and we also got a bunch of leaders um so yeah we gotta get rid of some of those so this guy sucks one go away um wow six one uh so he has eight points he has six points he has five five six points he has two points fire him um three points three three okay all the all, all, all the ones with three we still have six out of two um well i guess i'm gonna leave well, the fire with four maneuver. But it's a four maneuver guy. That's a four shock guy. Um. Yeah. I guess. I have to kick all of those. I kind of like to keep three of them. I mean, I I I know this is bad. I like to keep three of them. One is gonna die soon enough, anyways. Okay, but now we have to kind of distribute our armies. Our newly acquired army. Actually, do it this way. Ah, shit. You know what? Fuck it. You go over here. Here. Here, 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 and here. Whoa. And I think I'll turn off this fort as well as this one. Yazd yeah, is converted. Yeah, of course. No guy is not allied to me. Wait, I accept it? Now they don't like me as much. Oh, I lost my alliance with uh, Baluchistan. Okay, whatever. Um, in this case, you are allied to the Ottomans. Ooh, lovely. Um, I could boost stability. I'd rather not, though. Let's see what happens here. Okay. So, yeah, we have a lot of troops. Very nice stuff, indeed. I'll just turn off all of the forts. I'm not gonna go to war anyway. Great. So I was, wow, wow, army maintenance is quite expensive, you could say. Interesting. Uh, so this is too much to handle for our, our little economy. Um, recover neg negative stability, gain five prestige. That's That seems kind of shitty, but okay. Um, I guess the negative stability doesn't help. Uh, national unrest. Yeah, we, lo we lose a lot of trade power, it seems. But that's taxation is really the problem. Uh, we have like forced. We have like okay recent uprising. Forced conversion is negative three. Yeah, we have this tax. We're gonna get a lot of uh, income back once the forced religion comes uh, and goes away. Um, until then, let's get some claims. Fabricate claim on Shivan again. And uh, on tar Tarki. Whew. And he was actually. Oh, Shirvan is fighting this. Okay, some of this goes away, so we should get more tax then. Well, it was a 10 before. But yeah, look at this. So Rustrian. Now, sadly, it's still, still a lot of Zuni over there. I wish they would have taken over more provinces, but oh well. Oh well, what can you do? 
Um, yeah, not really. Timurid particularists. I have enough men to fight them at the moment, so I guess it's fine. But yeah, we're losing ducats quickly. Uh, maybe we don't need to fully maintain them? Maybe that's, uh, that's the thing. Still, that wouldn't help. Gee. Hmm. Not sure what to do, though. Okay, I guess 10% is probably the best we're ever gonna get. Uh, although, we can wait. There's no rush. There's no need to rush. How old is our guy? That's a good question. Because is he, if he's gonna... He's 20 only, okay. He's a 5 administrator. Come on, my tax should be higher now. 7. Hmm. Well, I can't keep this army going for forever. The particulars are gonna rise. Who else is rising? Well, I think once the particulars are uh, are done, we should um, we should certainly go and unfund the army. It's, until then, though, we'll we'll keep them. This guy is really not, not having a good time. He's being converted completely to Sunni. <sighs> Isn't that nice? Luckily I don't have such problems. I just have uh, prestige in the toilet, no stability, and uh, run a deficit like a... Like a bad government. <laughs> basically. Okay, get some more cause claims. He now wants a royal marriage even, but I don't want it. Don't you dare walk into my lands. Okay, how much tax am I getting? Uh, not too much. Come on, can you actually spawn, dude? Yeah, he's gonna spawn soon, says. Sunni Zealot actually did cross my borders. Well, let them destroy troops, whatever. It doesn't matter too much. Actually, no, it does matter because they want to retake my stuff. And I, that, that's kind of uncool. Because I'm Zoroastrian now. Totally forgot. Give me a good leader. Um, and the shock dude. Got it. I didn't even get stack wiped. When is he gonna arrive on 9th of November? Give me the shock guy. Sunni Zealots, man. Go to Kuzistan. Unmoth, uh, yeah, mothball this again. But this guy, who's running away, you should uh, totally. Thanks. Getting rid of some dudes at least. Save cash. Go there, combine. Oh man, just got an end of the month bonus. Didn't want that to happen. Okay, go here, go here, and go here. Great! So it's 720 24, so it's very. We're very close to this. Now the particulars rise up. Obviously. Obviously. And they've already taken this one fort shit. Alright. 
get this. Get these guys over as well. And obviously you. Of course I lost. Well, that was quick. How do you move here? Okay, yeah, this is difficult. All right, we caught him before he got the fort. Because it's a pain reseaching that. Took an. Oh, actually, this is a sender of trade, is it not? Okay, so I was lying before. We do have a sender of trade. We had one before. Shut the fuck up, man. How did he get. What? No fucking way. How did he siege it that quickly? That makes absolutely no sense. It's a freaking fort, dude. I don't get it. What? How do they siege this? I was. I'm. Honestly, they were not on the fort. They must have teleported there because I turned them on. How does it. What? Makes no sense. Literally, that makes no sense at all. But oh well, if you want to play games, uh, I'll play games. Oh no, we capped out on points. Shit, and I didn't notice. We need these points so it's desperately. Okay, now it has to be admin, economic, or innovative, and I like economic. I know innovative is also good, but I'd rather have economic. Thanks for the tax modifier, bozo. Go over here, destroy the guys. He's already movement locked, he's gonna attack me. I'll defend, and then I'll crush this guy. Nice. And I'm gonna lead the 4,000 men over there. Yeah, why do I walk with all of them in there? I don't know. And he'll go to Quasi. Okay, great. Great stuff, great stuff. Do we have a siege guy? Whatever, go in there. Nice. Okay. Who else is gonna rise up? Kivan Separatists. Uh, I'm not too happy about those guys. <sighs> Alright though. So let's look at some of the ideas we have. Uh, rights of admission, theologian stability of two, empire, and wow. Okay, so we yeah we just need to reform our government, um, but that's gonna that's gonna take some time. That will take some time. Sadly, and yeah, our legitimacy is dropping like a stone. Uh, yeah. No air. Fertility is bad. Right, they're almost gonna siege this. Noise. So we have 400, we can get the build cost. Great. That's actually a problem because right now, the most, most of the uh, prestige we're getting is from DK. And our first idea is prestige decay. So we're actually gonna stay at negative prestige for a longer time once we get our um, ideas. I hate that. Um, but I guess that is the way it is. Uh, use of separatism minus five, also nice. So yeah, um, the next idea group, I'm probably gonna wait quite a while before I get that one. 
Um, because, yeah, it's just, it just doesn't have anything. Ooh, someone's bankrupt. And the Ottomans... They actually just took one... They took two provinces, okay. A military dude died. Um, the reinforcement speed's not that cool. I don't want reinforcement speed, sorry. Not interested. Not at all interested. But the Ottomans still have no border with me, so I'm happy about that. And Shivan. I can fabricate one more claim. But they're allied to the Ottomans. Man. I have to fight the awesome Ottomans. But only the Ottomans. If no guy would join. I'm actually interested. If no guy would join. Um, then we might have a chance. Because Ottomans have rebels. Bulgarian separatists. And they would have to be able to walk through this land. Georgia might allow them. But maybe not. That would be cool. Alright. Um, I, but I need one more stability for that. In order to, that, for that to work out. Uh, pretend rebels in Hormuz. Okay. Get these guys going. You get uh, this leader. And these guys get the fast leader. Abdul. Yeah, so we need to declare a war. But for that we need to let people die in a quarantine. And next month we're gonna stab... Yeah, we're gonna use one stability to declare the war against the Ottomans. Because I believe they are not able to join. I'm not sure. Good. That was enough. If no guy joins, of course they don't. Do I, do I want to do this? Let's check out the Ottomans. Um, they have no manpower. But that doesn't mean anything. 35,000. I have 62,000 and I have way more manpower. But it doesn't mean anything again. Uh, conquer Crete. But I guess if they're stuck in a big war with me, they might actually have to face someone else. The Mamluks are currently busy. Lithuania seems like they are not interested in fighting anyone. Uh, I don't know if I want to take that risk. Although, hmm. I mean, Kara currently doesn't like me. But they're also... They rivaled me, so they are probably gonna. Well, I don't know if they're gonna give him any access. Who knows? Um, are these guys there yet? Oh, they are. Good. Fight these pretenders. But I really would like to declare this war. I mean, right now I'm pretty powerful. I would say. Like right, right now. I'm pretty strong. I feel strong. Uh, I mean, yeah, we have Kievan separatists. That's kind of annoying. Um, where are they getting power from, anyway? Copid Duck. Why are you guys so upset? Negative stability. Denied newborn daughter. Okay. Well, shit. I need a military advisor as well. Uh, but what, okay, what technology are you guys? Six. Oh, that's actually not that far away. I'm at least gonna be at five. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna think about if I declare war. I, I kinda want to. I'm not too sure. I kinda wanna declare war on Shiro and just take uh, all of their f five provinces or full provinces that I have a claim on. I don't know. Just so I can maybe reach over there. It just seems like a nice thing to do. Um, but yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching so far, I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, don't forget to like, comment, and even subscribe if you want to see more in the future. Um, but yeah, I'll see you next time. Steve Trunka, signing off.